Welcome back to the Marketing Sherpa Media Center at IRCE. I'm Marketing Sherpa reporter Allison Banco, joined by Lisa Foreman of Nations Photo Lab. Thank you so much for joining us. Yeah, thanks for having me. So your position is Marketing Conversion Manager. What do you do with Nations Photo Lab? Tell us about it. So I was brought on generally to do testing and to make the conversion rate better. Um, so a lot of my work resides in the testing tool that we use and um, just digging deep into the data, the Google Analytics, and constantly with iterations improving our website, um, whether it be on the product pages or the shopping cart or the catalog, site search, anything, just trying to create a better user experience um, and then track it to see how the changes are going. Excellent, and tell us about Nation's Photo Lab. What, what types of products do you offer? What are we talking here? Sure, so we sell professional, we sell to professional photographers. We're a photo lab, so we produce high-end photography products like really nice wedding albums, um, prints that will last for over 100 years, um, and anybody can shop with us. We traditionally serve professional consumers, but with e-commerce, we can serve anybody. So we have the prosumer and the consumer who come to our site and shop and um, yeah, we sell to pretty much anybody in the United States. We serve Canada and some international markets. Excellent. And tell us about some recent testing that you've done. Sure. So I recently redesigned, with the help of my developer, a new product page template. Mm -hmm. So we tested it out and we saw great success. I don't remember the numbers off the top of my head, mm -hmm. but the, the template that we had, some of the tests I feel like I have to find through customer service insight or through Google Analytics just noticing a complete outlier, but some of them in the beginning are always just intuition. So uh, our product pages were really long and there was no strong or clear call to action. So I designed a template with the help of the developer that um, has more of a traditional e-commerce feel. It has the images and the call to action with the price right at the top with the title and then the extra details below. Um, and we've, saw, we've seen huge success. So we're rolling it out currently to the rest of our product pages. Mm -hmm. uh, did the same thing with a product uh, comparison table. We uh, just had, kind of had a page thrown up there with a bunch of different pieces of information about our different paper types for our professional prints. Mm -hmm. um, and there was no clear way to identify the differences between the paper types and a consumer who comes to us who's not a pro and has never ordered with us at that point likely bounces because they don't know what the difference is, they don't know what to order. We give them analysis paralysis and they leave. So we've redesigned the catalog the kind of the product category pages and the product pages themselves using testing uh, to figure out what to do. And for the product category page, we had a couple of iterations. So we would run the tests, we would notice where consumers were getting confused and then we would do make some tweaks and then rerun the test. Um, Currently, the test we're running is sticky header. Mm -hmm. So we're having this header stay static as somebody rolls down the site, or stay at the top of their browser as they scroll down the site. So they can navigate to any other product. That way, if they go to the bottom, they didn't find what they're looking for, it's less likely that they're bounced because they might see something else that they were interested in at the top of our navigation. Interesting, and how many weeks into that test are you? We are only about two or three days. Uh, <laughs> yeah. So. It doesn't take long for some of our, our projects or tests to see statistical significance because we get a good amount of traffic, uh, depending on the page. If we're doing just a product page, it'll take one to two weeks. Uh, but with this test, I imagine we'll be done by the end of the week. And it, from what the data is showing, we'll likely be rolling out sticky header and then likely also applying those lessons to our other companies. Awesome. And at Marketing Sherpa slash Mech Labs, we're all about testing, so we love hearing success stories from that. Tell us how important it is for e-commerce marketers today to implement testing into their marketing mix. I can't even imagine not having it. Um, I mean, I'm in it, so I'm a little biased, but <laughs> I, it's my role. But I think that there's just so much opportunity and you're leaving money on the table if you're not, because you can have as much traffic being generated to your site and you can optimize your ads in AdWords or Facebook or wherever. But if you're dropping them off on not opti unoptimized landing pages, then you're leaving money on the table because you could be getting qualified leads, but if your website is not user friendly, then you're just not going to be able to convert the customers. So, and it's easy. Like the tools that they have out there today, it's a WYSIWYG editor. You can just kind of drag and drop as a marketer without technical experience. I can set up tests on my own without help from my developers for some of the tests. 
and I can declare statistical significance as soon as they're ready and get them rolled out. So it's really quick and easy and it's before you ever spend, invest any money in rolling out new templates or new pages on your site, I think you should definitely be testing them first because you could be developing and pouring resources into something that's not going to be beneficial to your website. A lot of great points, and actually it's really neat that your company has a dedicated position for, for that. Yeah. That's amazing. Yeah, it's really great. I've been there three months and it's been a dream job because I get to test and look at the numbers and watch how quickly the conversion rate can change based on just little tweaks. So it's really exciting because every day something's changing and every, everything's always improving. Excellent. Lisa, thank you so much for joining us in our media center yeah, today. Thanks and, for having me. And don't forget, you can view all of our videios online at marketingsherpa.com slash IRCE.